Hey everyone, it's TCS, and welcome to a game called The Walking Dead. This is the third time I tried getting the series to go forward, but the first two times it kind of fell flat. So I'm going to be trying all again. I'm going to be trying the rest again, alright? So, I hope you guys will enjoy the series as much as Mike will edit. Let's get started. So... This is a visual novel from Telltale, and by the way, the studio behind Le the people behind uh, Left for Dead or whatever, I I'm not sure if it's um if it's Valve, but they're make Overkill, Overkill. There's going to be a new Walking Dead series called Overkill the Walking Dead. It's time for them to start uh, something. Yeah, they're they're probably gonna have a lot of. It's probably gonna be a very good game if it's by the Overkill Studio. On the text selectables notifications. Why wouldn't I want that? Why is all that out of the place anyway? There. Now, let's get going. The chapter one of the first season, um, minimal. It seem, this is fine. So, we have episode one, episode two, episode three, episode four, and episode five, plus the special episode. One of the characters is in the second season that's in the special episode. And she may, plays a pretty major role. In the second season. I haven't seen anyone play The Walking Dead by Science PewDiePie for a very long time, so I have no idea what the outcome is going to be, even though people already told me. But, if that makes any sense, I would like to know. So this is Lee Everett. The gu he has been convicted for killing his wa for killing his wife's lover. We all know the story. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Um Yeah. Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. <laughs> um, every, every time? Every time? Every time. <laughs> okay. Seriously? I like the, I like the officer guy. But it's too bad he dies. I, we all know that. A little bit. You being a making boy. You're for making then. You're for making then. Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. Always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame, that is. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. Well, we make acquaintances, but he dies. Any of that seem important to you? All of it, but that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. <laughs> I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Sure. He just doesn't want him talking about his wife. Regardless, 
Could be you just married the wrong woman. Or maybe he just married the wrong guy. Or maybe, or, or I, maybe I did. Not gonna say F you to a cop. There we go. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you sit. And before long he starts kicking the back of the seat like like a fussy baby on an airplane. Not tell him he's gotta stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. Yes, so yeah. he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Um. So he. Man. Man? <laughs> Not even close. They caught the fucker red handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. He must be insane if that's the case. It goes to show. People will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Yeah. I got another good one for you. This one's a little There's bit a less walker. depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. What's this out? other time... Too late. And there it goes. And it's gone. I should watch the series. What's those stock screams? I'm serious. All the way back in 2012. They're making a fourth season of The Walking Dead. Game. The video game. Hey. Hey, officer. Are you alright? I'm still cuffed back here. No, he did. Officer? Oh, that doesn't look good. He wasn't ejected from the car. Yeah. Uh. 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 Doom! Right in there. They're making a fourth season. Drag myself out that window. They're making a third. They're making a fourth season, and it turns out it's actually one. It's the. It's called The Walking Dead, the final season. So there's no more seasons after the fourth one. It's literally called it the title, The Walking Dead. Ow. The wa The final season. And I bet you it's even. It's still gonna have Clementine. Crap, I should have down... Never mind. Dip up, up. Officer? God dang it. God damn. Yeah. Take God sh shotgun shell. You can put it inside there. I'm such a lunatic. Looks empty. That's why I grabbed the shell. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Yeah. So let's go all the way over there. Officer? God damn. Let's go all the way over there and see him come back to life. Oh yeah, one of the stuntmen for season 8 of The Walking Dead died. 
while they were in post-production. While they were in production. Yeah. And it turns out, um, the guy was, uh, he died from 15 feet. He died from a very... He basically died by by uh, from a long land from a long jump and he yeah he did and uh, they dedicated the first episode of the eighth season of the walking dead to him and george a. romero who also died earlier this year george a. romero was the guy's be was the guy behind uh the walk the original <laughs> dead series yeah <laughs> okay. So George A. Romero, rest in peace, man. You were one of the greatest movie producers to make the Night of the Living Dead series. My favorite is a reboot of Dawn of the Dead. Don't make me do this. A three, two, one, kapow! Right in the face hole. Right in the face hole. Actually, there's only like three. Holes in the face. Out of the frying pan into uh, into the stove or whatever. Help! Go get someone. There's been a shooting. There's Clem. <laughs> oh! Oh! Hello. <laughs> Uh, hello. Too bad you can't lip faster. You can't lip faster. Oh no. Oh, by the way, Mike, if you're listening, finish off Telltale Strong Bad. Uh, Cool attractive game for attractive people or whatever it's called. Telltale! Telltale. 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 Oh, 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 oh. oh. His faces are. His facial expressions are perfect. Oh, hello! He's waving! Have we ever. Notice, have you ever recognized who that, uh, have you ever met with that gunman? Whoever shot that gun, have we ever met him before? Hello? Anybody? No, no. Whoa. All right. Are you dead? Hey, are you dead? Hello, anybody home? I need a little help. I'm sure they won't mind. I'm Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? That's the first thing you always say when someone's trying to intrude your house. There's no one in the house. Ah, Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. How does he know? How does he know? These people might need more help than I do. That's nice. And now he has blood on him. Great. Yeah, you can't slip on it anymore. But now his clothes are dirty. You can't do anything about it. Three new messages. Message one, left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. 
Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. All right. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message 2. Left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. Why? Not Why would you drink that? Aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Who knows please, what that's from? Please, I never saw it before. And take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message 3. Left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. It's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. And they got bit. Kind of looks like a uh, Ber Bernie or huh? Big Bernie or whatever his name is. Uncle Hello? Bern, are you dying? You need to be quiet. I'm about to wab it. Uncle Burn, are you dying? Thank God of mercy I am. <laughs> I'm not a monster. Good. <sighs> Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Yeah! Before it. <laughs> and there she is! Right there! <laughs> Triangle! Right there, slip on the blood again and smack your head. Right there. <laughs> I'm sure that just got a lot of people back in the day. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. You're grabby, aren't you? You're a grabby woman. Uh, I, I guess I can. A lot of people are into that, I guess. But a lot of people are not. A lot of people are not into that, and that's basically the whole majority of the human race. They don't like grabby women. They don't. They freaking don't. They don't. Fatality. Do it one more time. That was the stock blood sound effect. Adventures in babysitting. What a way to go on the first day of babysitting a child. <laughs> Just some woman starts going at you, and then. Then, my God, my improvise, my improv skills are going Did through you the kill roof. It? Uh, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think so. Sometimes they come back. They always come hey, back. You kill one. I'll be no, back. I always one. come back. You've been all by yourself through this. But dying yeah, is such a bitch. It's a Chucky reference. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. But they get shot a lot. I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. Man, yeah, good idea. Good idea. What should we do now? We need to find help before it gets dark. It's about to press the other one. Yeah, it's not safe at night. I, I'm serious. I'm serious. What kind of high Let's drugs go. am I on? Stay close to me. I don't think she has a freaking choice, man. Let me tell you, Clementine, I don't know why she has to be so freaking adorable. I don't know why. So, Lee Ever will see you in the next episode. Ah!